Hello and welcome back. Uh, this is the second video of the um, big CNC machine project and uh, I already went ahead and I uh, manufactured, oh, 3D printed some of these um, bearing holders and uh, they work quite well. Um, the bearing fits in here very snugly and uh, this can be closed up with simple screws um, it's a very simple very simple design but uh, now for testing I think this will do uh, I plan I had a little plan change I'm going to fix these down on the main table and uh, then a second piece of MDF for a multiplex uh, will hold them from the side to give more stability. Um, apart from that, for the things that I will be doing with it, um, I think the 3D printed parts will be okay. Um, in the end there will be uh, threaded rods or very long screws going through here holding everything in place, so uh, we can eliminate backlash. I also printed a uh, a holder for a small stepper. Um, these are the same steppers used in 3D printers. Uh, for the for the final uh, machine, these will probably be too small and too low power. But now for testing, they're just fine. Um, each of these steppers has a uh, holding torque of. 40 newton centimeters, which translates uh, when you use the threaded rod to about five kilograms um, of holding force. So you could actually make it pull up to five kilograms, or um, have it push the uh, equal force. Um, I also decided on a name for the project. Um, the uh, machine will be called Big Rob. All of my 3D printers or plotters or everything are called Robin in memory of Robin Williams, um, who died on the first day that my printer started working. And uh, I felt very bad when he died, so everything's called a Robin now. Okay, this is it for today. I will start. Um, setting up something to test movement, speed, and power, and I'll report back when I'm done. Thanks for watching, and bye bye.